Go. My name is Robert Tolbert. I'm a skid rope homeless artist. And my piece is called Three Fifths Human. And the reason I named it Three Fifths Human is because in America's history, when they wrote the Constitution, it's a reference to African Americans. They didn't know what the fuck they do with us. See, at one time, when people when it came to property taxes, slaveholders didn't have to pay property taxes because slaves weren't considered property. They were considered livestock, like a cow or a pig or a goat or a lamb. So the northern states got mad. Now, like, wait a minute, we paying property taxes and you motherfuckers ain't got to pay property taxes because you own slaves? Uh-uh, they were going to succeed from the union. So what the, what the Congress did to keep the northern states from leaving the, union, the, the new nation they came up with this thing called the Three-Fifths Clause. And what it did, it said, okay, it, it allowed the federal government to tax slaveholders because uh, it, it, made, it made slaves three-fifths human. They didn't even classify Native Americans as three-fifths human. We're the only people that have ever been in the history of the United States that were classified as a fraction of a human being. And that's why I call this piece Three-Fifths Human. And where are you showing it? Tell me about this place. Uh, this is the Skid Row uh, Museum and Archive. And it's, for, it's a place where homeless artists can display their works. Yeah. It's right here on Spring Street, right across from the uh, six, the, the Spring, the Spring Street, the Sixth Grand, Street, Grand, Grand Market. Marketplace, no. right across the street. Okay. And people, for people not know, to know about this place and what's going on here, that's a travesty in itself. Oh, there's another big exhibit that's going on that's very important called the Take Action Campaign. And it's at a big warehouse facility that they took over in North, uh, North Spring Street uh, near Chinatown. So come on down and check it out. Thank you so much, Robert.